Hello guys, this is Anish Fridge here with another tutorial and this is on how I animate walk cycles and all the cycles you can think of. It's a one hour um, tutorial but I made it a time lapse because it just took one hour. So I guess I could explain everything here. So what I did was I made this layout and then I grabbed all the moving objects into this timeline manager here. Then I keyframe everything at zero and then I made the position the record button and then made the position first position of a walk and then I go to the next place and quick hotkey for keyframing everything is you hit Q on the keyboard on the timeline while you have the timeline selected and then it keyframes everything that you previously keyframed so I hope that makes sense uh, and then I make the first the second pose of the thing well, the walk cycle which is uh, which I'm not showing right now but uh, <laughs> kind of difficult to do this uh, so what I do is I first make the walk and then I in, in the middle of each keyframe I make the new uh, small tweaks to it then I animate the arms later and then the body movements later mm -hmm. So you can just observe and we'll see what I'm doing and get an idea how I animate the walks and stuff. So just this walk took half an hour. Half an hour. Then the running and everything took less time. The walk is actually the most difficult for me for some reason. Uh, I wanted to take this time to also explain that 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 someone has been accused of selling my rig for cheaper prices. Uh, I don't know if it's true, so I'm not gonna name names just yet uh, until I have a hard evidence that it is him and it is true that he's selling my rig. If you have any idea who it is, um, tell me because. There's one guy who says, this guy's selling this rig for you, and then the other guy's saying, no, this is Photoshop and stuff, and then I'm like, what is happening? And then they're like, I, I don't know if it's one person with 10 accounts. Oh, this is important. Look at the F-curves. Um, whenever I go into that mode again, look at the F-curves. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, so this guy, he's, um, they're like, I get an inbox where, like, five people have sent me messages saying this guy is, um, is selling my rig but the problem is I think this guy has five accounts and he's just trying to mess with me or something that trying to get revenge on him or something I have no idea because I known this guy for a while he's not the type of person who would sell my rig just like that he might be I don't know we don't know anyone really in the internet world so now I'm starting my run cycle uh, anyway, uh, if you know anything about it, tell me. And, uh, yeah, I might start playing music soon. Uh, oh, yeah, my animation. Uh, I'm about three fourths done. It is coming out well. I'm starting to improve a lot more on speed and timing and everything, but now. I really need a better computer because it's just messing me up. I need a computer that can render because my computer, whenever I render something, it just it slows down so much, and I'm running out of memory, and it is horrible. So yeah, you can help me out by going to my animation channel and liking my animations and stuff. <laughs> Plus buying my rigs and not getting pirated ones <laughs> um, okay take a look at the F curves if, if the F curves are not straight in a straight line uh, or the beginning has to have a, like a small curve like that on the position because it slows down it starts slow and then it speeds up and then it's a linear sort of thing when it's running so take a look at those F curves you need to under the control the main now like the body now so check that out and then 
Yeah, you should already know about this if you watch my timing tutorial and stuff. Uh, so, yeah. Computer. The story is basically based on. Actually, Enderbrine. It's Enderbrine Part 2. The reason why I'm making it about samurais and stuff is because I wanted to add a, um, a unique char character and kind of a sad story. <laughs> Uh, but this is part two. Part three should be. It'll be more focused on other things such as comedy and bringing together the two characters that are going to be the main characters, plus maybe one more. Because the the rule of three is pretty good, cool, I guess. <laughs> and then, yeah. Um, I don't know what else to talk about. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna be like bootstrap talking about random things. Uh, okay, I can't do that. He's very, he's a very unique guy. One of my idols because he doesn't try, but he's really good. Like when, when I saw his comment, he said that uh, his artwork, like when if you go to his channel, I'll put the link in the description. His um, time lapses of his artwork and stuff. If you watch that, his artwork is pretty cool. And he said that he's never truly really had any art classes or anything like that. And except for figure drawing, which is kind of weird. Uh, and. Well, I guess figure drawing would have probably helped him animate, but yeah, he takes his job pretty seriously, I guess, because animating, you, you need to be perfect, I guess. Uh, if you make a, like a, like a small error, everyone will see it, and, but that's when you're professional, but right now, and this, these stages, it doesn't have to be perfect, I'm just looking for views and then starting my channel up and then buying a new computer and then starting more professional work like VM comics and stuff uh, half of you are probably not even listening to me or don't even speak English <laughs> uh, what else to talk about I might be going into I might if I start my if my animation channels get big I might buy one of those pads for drawing and stuff and start doing stuff like bootstrap and make it my own show kind of thing series as you can see that's the walk now upstairs it looks pretty cool uh, I hope these tutorials help you uh, yeah and if you want, you can t leave a comment suggesting a tutorial. And uh, but I'm not gonna go to all the tutorials I've already gone through, such as how to do my mouth. Um, that mouth is it's just watch Bootstrap's tutorial, uh, Bootstrap's time lapse, and it shows you how to do it. And then watch my tutorial on rigging, and you can come up with a mouth like mine. I just don't, I just don't want to give away everything. But I already have. If you just, if you know how to implement it correctly, you can make my this same um, exact rig. I have no secrets, really. I'm serious that uh, it's not me. It's you guys who don't figure it out because uh, I've already covered how to switch out objects and stuff. I have covered Expresso, except for the auto move because that is very too complicated. Very, very too complicated to explain. Uh, it's actually once you get the hang of it, it's not complicated, but not until I learn how to use it correctly. Like how to, um, it's easy to get it, uh, easy to make a very simple version of it, but difficult to make a like a real cool looking walk cycle from it. Plus, have the rig be. Um, uh, Rick B in a good mode, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, uh, and 
it's my first ever sort of talk to you guys, I guess. Uh, what else to talk about? Uh, I might not finish Underbarine part through soon. Might be in February or something like that. Might even be for a long time because I have some schoolwork to do also. Charge, computer charge. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, more else to talk about. Uh, I'm also doing a collab, 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 whatever, with Machinima. It is going to be pretty awesome animation because this guy is like a professional with Adobe RFX. He's gonna be doing special effects and the editing, sound editing and stuff. I'm just gonna give him the scenes and the sets and everything. Uh, he doesn't... Uh, whatever. I'll, I might put this channel link in the description. I'm really excited to work with him. He is... Um, yeah, uh, it's, gonna, it's not gonna be like... Uh, it's gonna be posted on Machinima's channel, not on my channel. And if that does well, I can buy my own computer. Just through that, and then yeah, I'll be really happy. Oh, on this, I do well at school, and my parents buy me a computer. I think that's the best option. So I'm gonna probably stop animating for a while and get on to schoolwork. So yeah, maybe that. Uh, so we're almost coming. We're coming close to the finish. Uh, yeah. So thanks for watching. Links in some links in the description. Whatever links I talked about, Bootstrap and Arrow Studio. So bye. Thanks for watching.